in our business, you know, obviously we make car racks, but we're really about our community and we have a great cycling community in Boulder. And we sort of wanted a venue to get everyone together. And, you know, there's places in town where it can happen, but we wanted to have, like, have fundraising events for these great organizations like Just Go Harder, um, where we can get guys like Timmy Duggan and Rory Sutherland to come by and pour beers. And it's so great because everyone can just talk to them like they're their best friend. And it's so nice to see them in this environment. They're not these elite cyclists who are in this little bubble. They can just come down and pour a beer and talk to them. And it's, uh, this is actually our third one. And uh, we get some mountain bikers, some road guys, some advocates, and uh, they've actually all been a banner success. It's been really fun. This fall for 2012, we're giving away a couple of uh, scholarships from the Just Go Harder Foundation. Uh, one of them, one organization uh, that benefits is the Eldora Mountain Ski Club, who's actually here tonight. Uh, so we'll, we'll be giving one scholarship to a, a ski racing athlete for them this, this coming winter. Uh, furthermore, we're giving away two scholarships this year to the Colorado High School Mountain Bike League. Uh, they're just starting their season right now, and the Colorado High School Mountain Bike League is really taking off. I think there's upwards of four or five hundred racers in the in the state now in only its second year of racing so it's, it's pretty phenomenal i think there's a lot of potential and it's really getting a lot of kids foot in the door in the sport of cycling so uh, i'm happy to be a part of that with just go harder back in australia in 2006 a bit of time off and uh you know, wasn't riding my bike a whole lot, wasn't really feeling like uh, dealing with the world a whole lot either. Uh, so, got a local, got a job in one of the, the local brew pubs near where I live back in Australia and yeah, pulled beers and had fun and stayed up late and did that for six months and realised that it wasn't really the lifestyle that I wanted and back to bike riding. Timmy won nationals, and uh, I was like, wow, local kid winning nationals, that's awesome. And, uh, you know, they always make stars and stripes uh, bike frames for the rider and jerseys. I was like, we're going to make them some stars and stripes racks. So uh, I called our guys down at Ink Monster, who do all the wrapping for us. Uh, we did a design in-house and sent it to them, and they wrapped some trays for us. And uh, it was actually a surprise for Timmy tonight. So we were really psyched, and when we, you know, unveiled him for him, he was really happy. So it was really fun. I'm really humbled to have received this custom bike rack. That's a that's a pretty cool perk, and I'm gonna display it proudly on my on my car for sure. Some cars you can see which car is yours in the parking lot because you you have a Rocky Mount that's bright green or bright orange. But in Boulder, there's a lot of cars with Rocky Mounts that are orange or green or blue. But I, I don't think there will be anyone else with this one. So I'll definitely be able to find my car in the 29th Street parking lot. <laughs> 